Hey there, Sonal Peeps, Henry here. So here we have a sagittal image of the liver showing an isoechoic lesion or mass. This mass is located anterior to the IVC. On top of being isoechoic, it is also slightly heterogeneous, especially when compared to the rest of the liver echotexture. The lesion does have some vascularity to it and a kind of spoke wheel pattern. And here's a transverse image showing the mass again. It is clearly uh, well defined. Now when we see a lesion in the liver of an adult, the first thing that comes to mind is hepatocellular carcinoma, because that's the most common malignant tumor of the liver in adults. And when doing pediatrics, we tend to think of hepatoblastoma, because that is the, no the most common malignant tumor in pediatrics. This, however, is a focal nodular hyperplasia, or FNH, which is a benign lesion. It's the second most common benign lesion of the liver, only secondary to hemangioma. Now, a lesion like this would need further characterization with MRI, with hepatocyte-specific agents to further characterize the lesion as an FNH versus some type of malignant tumor. Now, a few clinical characteristics. These lesions are very rare in children and are most commonly seen in young women of childbearing age. These lesions are not true neoplasms and are believed to be just hyperplastic nodules of liver parenchyma that lack normal hepatic architecture. They can be single or multiple, they can be isoechoic or hypoechoic, like this nodule here seen in liver segment 2, and lack a true capsule. And that's FNH in a nutshell. So to recap, second most common benign tumor of the liver, second only to hemangioma. Very rare in children, most commonly seen in young women of childbearing age. Often hypoechoic or isoechoic, often solitary, but sometimes multiple in 13% of cases. Hope you found this useful, and as always, stay tuned for more.